Hi guys, how are you guys? Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to yet another video. Thank you so much for tuning in. Very much welcome. Ika malamu Pirile Papla, just in case we've got new viewers. My name is Pirile Papla. Thank you so much for tuning in to Pirile Papla's entertainment. Please consider subscribing, like the video, share the video as well. Put your notification bell on so that each and every time when I upload the video and then you get notified. Please practice liking the video. It is absolutely free, you guys. You like the video and you can hala ha. You can just like you know and share and do as long as seula please you guys because i'm so disappointed i can see the views and the likes no balance at all you guys five likes could video and more than 100 views or like 1.5 views you know something like that uh but only 10 likes or less than that like guys do you think in plan we would like how you are going to be charged something it doesn't work like that you just like it. that's it while you are watching, you just like the video. You guys, no charges at all. Now I want to talk about the producer, you guys, who's always into drama. If it's not a baby mama drama, it's a family drama. I do not know, you guys, who's here, 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 who did he kidnap this time? There was a drama about him now raising a daughter. One said she is Fisho Nguane's daughter. There is a drama here about him and the baby mama. There is a drama about the family. Ever since he, he took in that daughter, one said his family turned uh, uh, against him. He even uh, cut off his mother. He's no longer supporting his... Yo, all those dramas, guys, in this little season, we put Siabonga Shibe. We all know him a lot when it comes to Uzalo and uh, Generations. And there is a new you guys. This man is an actor. He's a very, very good actor. But drama always follows him. I do not know. Uh, she's, he's being accused of kidnapping. And as this popular actor, Siabonga Shibe, is accused of kidnapping and assaulting and stealing from a cousin of his former wife from Tabong in the Free State. The actor who plays a strict husband and a father on Mzansiwe to telenovela Usbongile and the Tlaminis is said to have kidnapped 19-year-old Karabo Patrick Litualo in December last year. Muzimocha has seen the police statement by Litualo where he gives a blow by blow of the incident. Hey, Usiabonga Shipe, kuningi nga you guys. These kidnapping allegations according to Litualo, the reason for this kidnapping are stemmed from Shipe demanding to see his 10-year-old child. Litsualo said the former Izo Izo and the wife Ekta arrived at his home uh, in uh, Allen Ridge Free State on the 3rd of December about half past 9 p.m. driving a maroon Hyundai with his elder daughter Unom Tandazo Ngobo and another passenger. I think the Unom Tandazo daughter is the one who once said Unom Tandazo Swiss Wingwane and then Wabuya Watu Unom Tandazo Siabonga Shipi and then his family was not approving. This is the daughter who made him fight with his family. Unom Tandazo, who's written here, you guys. Unom Tandazo, or something like that. Usi Abonga demanded his child from me. Uh, let me see here. Um, his elder daughter, Unom Tandazo, and another passenger. There was another passenger. Then Usi Abonga demanded his child from me, and I told him that I don't know where his child is. He then ordered me to go inside the car, and they drove on the 30... Uh, I do not know it's 30 Ara Road or 30 Rand Road. <laughs> and, guys, you guys. Uh, and on reaching the mine, um, three target shaft, the driver stopped the vehicle and Sia asked me about his child again. Ulitualo in an affidavit, okay? He alleged Ushipe slept him uh, uh, three times and that he cried. And um, this is the cousin to to the, the child, right? Uh he cried and that Unom Tandazo took out a firearm pistol. The Unom Tandazo is the Siabonga Shipe daughter, remember? Took out the firearm, the pistol from the car and gave it to the actor, U Siabong. On seeing the firearm, I told Sia that his child was in Tabong. They drove to my auntie's place in Tabong where they started searching for the child. I think U Siabong wanted to see his son, but the mother of the child does not want Siabonga Shipe to see. This is why the drama of the kidnapping and all that, you guys. Um, so I then got a chance to escape and hide at my friend's home. Uh, he, he said that... Uh, he also lost his phone during the kidnapping as he had to leave the car for his own safety when Shibe was searching for his son. 
so he meant business to see a there when he said i want to see my son and there was a drama with this little Alo guy and hey good morning you guys sheep who has been appeared on the two, 2003 movie james's journey to jerusalem has not been short of controversy last year december was much reported that ship abandoned his family after nom who came into his life remember i told you in the beginning this nom a child of siabonga shibe once said um tanaka's fishing one there was a whole lot of this girl being a fishing one child she then changed her mind to say the father is usiabonga shibe and the family siabonga shibe wasn't approving and then there was drama there we saw the story i think i did this story as well right so again, uh, she abandoned his family after Nom Tandazo came into his life uh, and claimed that she is his long lost daughter. So Shippe's brother Unati said the actor even told their mother that he wanted nothing to do with her and stopped buying the groceries for her when she tried to warn him about the long lost daughter Nom Tandazo. Uh, so just last month, uh, four students accused him of promising to pay their uh, college fees at a film school. Then he didn't fulfill his promise. Some of the students were forced to drop out of film school as their families could not afford to pay the fees. Ushipe could not be raised for a comment, but Unom Tandazo, who is also his manager and his daughter as well, uh, refuted the allegations and said that they went to his ex's place in peace uh, to drop off Christmas and birthday gifts for the son. Now those people are lying Uti uh, dead and I went there to drop off the gifts and his grandma um, then refused us access to my brother. We decided to ask Ukarabo to show us where the boy was and he made us drive around for hours and we eventually dropped him and came back without seeing the child. Now she also said that there was um, never a gun involved. My father would never allow me to carry a gun but the guy said there was a pistol in the car so when he saw the pistol he then managed to run away. Hey, yo. I do not know, guys, and then the theft case was opened up. The Free State Police spokesperson, Captain Stephen Tagging, confirmed that only a case of theft uh, of a cell phone was registered uh, at Allen Ridge on 4 December 2023. It is alleged that a 46-year-old driver was with his daughter and a 19-year-old complainant in a car. He left the cell phone inside the vehicle. The driver realized that there was a cell phone when a cell came in and uh, he took it back to the residence of the complainant. A case was registered for further investigation. The warning statement of a 46-year-old man was obtained. Investigations has been completed and the docket has been handed to the prosecutor for a decision. I do not know him and his daughter, this one, the alleged long lost daughter. I think they went to see the other son because Usia Bongaship has got a baby mama. So when they went there to see the child and then if family that's when the drama started. Um there was someone who was uh this carabo guy bam gen semo training they drove around with him would he show us where the child is and then the what 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 all that drama of the gun that was never there and you know what uh, uh this is kind of ship is going with his nom tanda's daughter and the driver something like that you guys this is how i understand the story it's so bad but i can tell what he wanted to see his child he went to drop off ama gives a birthday and all that but it sounds like the mother's family side, they do not want Usia Bongashipe to see the child. He keeps forcing things. Kesebem Vulele kidnapping and stealing. And because this man or this guy whom they threw in the car is the one who was supposed to show them where the child is. He's the one who's been so, like, kidnapped <laughs> since they are opening a case of a, case of a kidnap. He's the one who claims to be kidnapped and the cell phone stolen there and, and, and. But anyways, we can tell what he was trying to see his child, but it didn't go well. They ended up fighting. So yeah, hey, angers, hohongata. If there's any message you guys like the video, subscribe, share, and yeah. I'll see you again on my next upload. Bye.